distant You know I fear commitment Or do I really DM me, call me, I'm here to listen I was in London, be bumping up at the sound check You say your life's a movie, you ain't left your town yet My only baggage, Louie I got your back like Chewy But now I'm solo, we don't have to chat about it, do we? I'm getting dope, but well, we got a special, yes I know Let's let it grow, that's the M-I, double S-I-O Back in the game, I'm traveling Back in the van, unraveling Capital gain, I dabble in After the fame, I'm cashing in or cashing out Rap performing, got me passing out As it rain comes after the drought Have me forming, that's no doubt Gene Simmons, way these Swedish women need to kiss them I speak in wisdom, yo, these girls, they don't even listen Overseas, we had, how to the crack of dawn Trailblaze to the is gone When luck is lasting long Tears will flow to the notes of the saddest song But for now I gotta go Cause I'm a Well, the challenge has been laid and it's been accepted. Time to find out who gets chirping rights in this one. to drop the puck on this one. Put 
the chatter aside, the puck is dropped. Here we go. Puck moved over to Fiddler. Sends it deep inside the offensive zone. And he loses both the puck and his balance after that hit. Slides it across to Roberts. Oh, the defender has none of that. Yeah, he's in great position there to stymie that attempt. Passes over to McLeod. Quick feed to Fisher. There's the whistle. Offside is the call. Stopping the play. James Sabalski, Ray Ferraro with you here in the early going of this period. The game is still scoreless. Slides in off the wing after the centerman tied him up. Here's a chance. Stopped by the goaltender. And he regains control of the puck. Here's an odd man rush. Puts it on net. Oh, he gets a blocker on it. What a reaction. Adirondacks got the puck against the boards. That pass doesn't go. Here's a short pass to Fisher. The Icemen have taken over in the neutral zone. Offside the call, and we'll have a face-off just outside the blue line. Melton's won the draw here in the neutral zone. Coughs it up at center. Denies him with the pad. He reacts late, but he makes a save through traffic. Getting closer to the halfway point of this frame. Still looking for our first goal. Offense his own face off and he wins the draw. Moves it quickly over to Fisher. Stones him in front. The setters will glide into the dot. Locks them up on the draw as they take possession. Adirondacks got a hold of it along the wall. Takes it and looks ahead. Adirondacks got it in the neutral zone. Fiddler's got it against the boards. Takes the shot. Passes it to Roberts. Toronto's got the puck along the wall. Long reach breaks up the momentum. Slides the puck to Allen. Couldn't connect, although not exactly an ideal pass to begin with. Puck grabbed by Roberts. Adirondacks looking to break out of their own end. And gets it in deep in the opposite corner. Quick shot. Comes up with the block. Looks to make a play over to Roberts. And now he angles it across to Marks. Just a great defensive read there. Slides it across. And he comes up with it. Gets control of the puck right in front of his own end. And they manage to clear it. Adirondacks got the puck along the wall. Let's Uses the force on that hit. Toronto's ready to go on the attack. Bumped off the puck. Moves it to Fiddler. Toronto's got the puck inside the defensive zone. That pass goes a little sideways. Takes the pass from the left wing. And he blocks the shot. Great defensive play. Sends it quickly to Fisher. Moves the puck. Throws it on goal. Oh, has the goalie beat, but puts it wide. By not very much. This is a guy that knows how to score. He just misses the net by a narrow margin here. Quick pass to Melton. Sent into the offensive zone. Slides the puck over. And now he tries to get it across to Roberts. Fiddler's got the puck. Quick feed to Melton. And he makes the save. Here in the later stages of this period, we've still got zeros on the board. And they take possession. Nice job tangling him up on the draw. Right up the gut into the attacking zone. Fisher's got him along the boards. And that's picked off. Subers is on top of the puck, stopping the play. Looks like he's seen enough. The potential to start running around in your zone causes him to cover the puck up. The centermen glide into position. And as the puck is dropped, they win the draw here inside the defensive zone. The Icemen have it on the attack. Here's a pass down low. And sends it just out of reach. Spectacular stop by the goaltender. How did he hang on to that? 
Now, by being in the right position, James, he gets so tight to the shooter, there's nowhere for the puck to go. Here's a short pass to Fisher. From in close! Oh, that gets a piece of the stick! Yeah, he's a sharp save, James. Right in the middle of the ice, he makes the stop and pushes it away. There's the whistle. Oh, he's trying to box him out. This getting a little testy. Melton's done everything here except pull the other guy's gloves off. Fisher's won the draw. Takes it right in the chest. And the referee has blown his whistle, bringing a stop to the play. There's the horn bringing period number one to an end. Still no score in this one. head to the respective rooms. Two more periods still to come. We're looking forward to it here on EA Sports. My partner in crime, Ray Ferraro, is rested and refreshed. Along with the teams, we're ready to get things underway. Both teams still feeling each other out after a scoreless 20. Let's see if that changes here in period number two. Well, this one underway. Ray, give us an update on what your assessment is to this point. Man, that was slow, James. That first period, nobody generated any offense. Just a few shots to test the goaltenders. Still plenty of time left in this frame. We're still scoreless. And with the two tied up off the faceoff, a great read to grab possession of the puck. And they'll be forced to tag up after that missed pass. Toronto's across the blue line. Adirondack's got a hold of it against the wall. Slides the puck across to Stevens. Sends the pass over. Toronto's got control of it now from their own end. Moves it quickly over to Fisher. Finds nothing but air on that shot. Marks explores his options behind the net. He says, let's get physical on that play. Adirondacks gain possession along the boards. They try to maintain possession inside the defensive zone. Moves it to Melton. Nice pass. And that goes off a player in front. Toronto's got the puck in their own end. Picked up along the wall by Roberts. Tries to make a move and can't hang on to the puck. There are times you try to do too much. He's got good hands, but maybe a more simple play is the right one there. And now it's over to Fiddler. Centering pass! Oh, and he can thank his stick for that one! Yeah, he's right in front of the puck, too, so there's really nowhere that puck's going to squeak through. Offside is the call that will have a face-off just outside the offensive zone. Still a lot of time left in the period as we approach the midway mark. Still no score in this one. Fisher's won it. Feeds the puck to McLeod. Dishes it to Roberts. Quick pass to Fisher. Gets a glove on it to make the save. Puck possession so critical. Another faceoff coming up here. Adirondack's got a hold of the puck and tries to make a diagonal pass to Fiddler. From the left side, it moves to the middle of the ice. He almost lost it for a second there, but regains control of the puck. Quick pass across to Marks. Rocks him into the offensive zone. Adirondacks got the puck along the boards. Nice poke check. Quick feed to Melton. They've got numbers to his teammate. That goes wide. 
The Icemen have taken possession along the wall. And that puck leaves the zone. Toronto's on the attack. Takes the puck at the point. Looks like there's a delayed penalty being called here by the officials. And there's the whistle stopping the play. Let's see what the officials are calling. He's getting called for interference here. He doesn't seem to like it. You like the call? I like the call. It's a good check. Hey, he doesn't have the puck, though. That's interference. You can't do that. Toronto sending their power play unit out for the first time tonight. It's their first power play of the game. What a great chance to break this scoreless tie. Start with a face-off win. Get the puck to the point and start moving it around before you attack the net. Have a clear plan. The Icemen have gained possession off the wall. Here's a short pass to Fisher. Tees him up! Oh, what a stop! Scooped up along the wall by Roca. And now he moves it to Marks. And that one's broken up by a great defensive play. Fires it into the offensive zone. The Icemen have gained control of the puck along the wall. Taken by Roca. Looking to make something happen in the offensive zone. Comes up with a stop. And another stop. Oh, he's walked right in. A couple of stops in a row there. More than half the period has gone by. Hope you're enjoying this one. Still scoreless in this one. Puck is dropped and he wins the draw here in the defensive zone. And a successful clearing attempt. Toronto's power play comes up empty-handed. We're back to even strength on the ice. Too passive, not aggressive enough. The puck gets moved around the outside of the penalty killers. Really doesn't become a dangerous power play. There's the whistle. Offside is the call. Play set to resume with the face-off ready to go. Fisher's one possession. And now it's grabbed by Marks. Broken up at center. Move to the middle. Here's a shot. Blocker save. Slides it back to the blue line. Another stop by the goaltender. In the final moments of this period, the game is still scoreless. Melton's won the faceoff deep inside the offensive zone. Adirondacks got the puck against the boards. Moves it quickly over to Melton. Toronto's got a hold of it along the wall. Slides it over with pace to Shockey. Too much congestion blocks the shot. Moves the puck along the half wall. Can't connect. Moves it to Shockey. Takes the feed. Too much traffic in the lane. Taken along the wall by McLeod. Adirondacks got the puck along the wall. Right up front. Rocked him in the open ice. Big time defensive play. And now he angles it across to Marks. Takes it across the blue line. Centered out in front. Can't connect. Huge play in his own end to come up with the puck. Takes a shot. Denied by the goaltender. Still zeros on the board as the second period comes to an end. still to come. We'll get ready for it. Hope you'll join us. Intended target. Quick feed to Marks. 
Couldn't make that one happen. Sends a pass over. Here's a shot, and that one stopped. Slides the puck down low. Adirondacks got it from behind the net. And as he stumbles, he coughs up the puck. Knocked around, but keeps it going. And he'll likely feel that one in the morning. Quick feed to Melton. Aaron pass, and the play's broken up. The Icemen have gained control of the puck in their own zone. Pushes it across to Fiddler. Takes the feed in the middle of the neutral zone. Made the save on the play. Lots of time left in this period. Still looking for our first goal. Nice job tying up his opponent. Gets in front of it. Again, the denial by the goaltender. Quick reflexes. You make one, you make two stops before the puck is cleared away. Roberts plays it now. Kind of lost control for a second there, but regains possession. Can't catch up to the pass. Adirondacks got it along the wall. And that's picked off in front. Tries to get it to Roberts. Here's a short pass to McLeod. Swing and a miss. I think it's a chance for a breather here as he hangs on and covers the puck up. Who, for the players or for you? Well, you know, I won't complain. Inching closer to the midway mark of the period. We've still got zeros on the board. Fisher's won the draw here in the offensive zone. Adirondacks got a hold of it against the wall. A chance in front, and they can convert to the play. And that's broken up with a stick in front. Here's a chance, a two-on-one. And the shot dies in the traffic jam. And now he tries to get it across to Fiddler. Sends it across. And now it's over to Shockey. Let's it go! Gives up the body for the block. And that's broken up. And he slides it quickly to Roberts. Sends it over. Here he is with the backhander. Dismiss that chance. Ahead of steam now towards the front. And they'll dump it in. Toronto's got it in their own zone. Takes the pass. Moves it quickly over to Fisher. Feeds the puck across to Allen. On the doorstep. Oh, he scores! Man, you haven't had a chance to use that tonight. Finally, somebody scores a goal and we have a lead. Hopefully I didn't boot that one. Adirondacks found themselves a critical goal here late in the third period. Now a question is, hanging on, can they do it? I think they can, but it has to be by being aggressive. You're now into the last half of the period. The clock goes pretty fast if you're aggressive. Feeds the puck over to Fiddler. Here's the pass. Melton's dangerous, and he's got the puck now. He had the go-ahead goal earlier on. On the doorstep, on the backhand. He was locked in there. This is a quality chance that the goaltender turns aside right from the slot. That's a good heads-up play at center ice. Pokes the puck away. Sends it in on the attack. Came up with the save on that play. Alvalin's probably the one reason that this game is the way it is. His save percentage has been outstanding. Late goings of this period. 1-0 is where we sit at this point. Fishers won a big draw on their own end. Skates across the blue line. Adirondacks gain possession along the boards. McLeod's got the puck along the wing. Moves it to Melton. And couldn't find the intended receiver on that one. Pokes it away to stay on the attack. Manages to hang on. Couldn't connect on that pass. Quick pass to Allen. Here they are on the attack. And he takes a shot. Oh, he stops him with a glove. Great reflexes there. Adirondacks offense, the story tonight as they lead it here in this third period. Back underway as he wins the draw inside the offensive zone. Stick saved by the goaltender. Denies him again. A big draw looming here in the offensive zone. Adirondacks got it and they're on the attack. And he stands tall in goal. Quick feed to Marks. And that's taken by the defense. 
trying to make something happen while trailing, and this one doesn't complete. Here's a shot with the stop. Here's Whoa. a chance. He scores! On the rebound, lights the lamp for the goal. Officials getting ready to drop the puck. Puck possession so key in today's game. Inside of the final minute here in the third. Adirondack's got the puck. Shockey stick handling in his own zone and tries to make a diagonal pass to Melton. What a steal in his own end. Adirondack's got it now. Coughs up the puck after that hit. Levels him with the hit. Slides it quickly to Marks. Along the half wall with the puck. Oh, he looks like he's banged up there. He's going to try and finish the shift, but he's pretty clearly not at 100%. Slides it across. Here's a chance. Scores! They are on fire. Yeah, and it's all different sources, too. Score a goal, make a change, get another one. Nothing seems to slow them down. There's not much of a line here between him stopping this and what happened. The puck hit him and went into the net. I thought he had it. This neutral zone faceoff set to go, and we are back underway. Here's a short pass to Melton. Right up front, and that one's broken up by a great defensive play. And we are all over with this one tonight. Well, that's it. Give them credit for their fearlessness, but that's about it, Ray. Bad decision to challenge these guys to a game.